Today we're unboxing the Elatech Smart Wi-Fi Digital Temperature Controller, or as I like to call it, thermostat. And uh, we got the US version here, so it's going to come from the factory loaded with Fahrenheit. And it goes from negative 40 Fahrenheit all the way up to 230 degrees Fahrenheit. So it has a, it has a good range. I plan on using this unit for a saltwater fish tank, but some people will uh, use it for maybe like a home brewery, um, greenhouses, reptiles, on and on and on. Here's the manual. So you might be asking why would I want one of these? I have a heater that already controls the temperature by itself. Well, if the heater malfunctions, this will catch it and shut it down before you like lose livestock or plants or stuff like that if, if it gets stuck in a heating position. So it's a good safeguard. There you have the cooling and the heating. So you hook your heater to the one and a chiller if you have a chiller or a cooling fans to the other. Temperature probe that plugs in. It's a uh, plugs in so I guess you could replace it if it gets all nasty or something you can buy another one. It really has like a sleek design to it compared to some of its competitors. Here we got it uh, plugged in and it's saying it's 78.3 degrees currently. Oh, it just changed. 78.2 degrees currently. And the unit came set from the factory for 77 degrees and 3 degrees difference. So it would be 80 degrees for the cooling and 74 degrees for the heating for the kick on and off. Uh, that's all changeable with the app. So let's get the app. You're, there's going to be two of them. You're going to want the Elatec I Cold. And then on the back of the unit, there's going to be a QR code, and that's how you're going to hook it up to your home Wi-Fi system. So once you get the app, everything's controllable. You can change all the parameters. Um, this is the home page. And all the parameters can be changed to whatever you choose. It uh, logs all the data, so that's like minute by minute. The temperature changes, so you can see spikes or crashes and maybe save livestock or plants, like I was saying. Um, let's peel this off, and we're going to put this in my saltwater tank. And if you want to see an actual review on this product, leave some comments below, and uh, thanks for watching.